And you got to be special when you know I can't have you When I'm under the next one, oh, I know you want me to grasp it Oh, do you mean you keep on making me be Nightmares turn into a dream If it's a toxic to me, what am I feeling? Cause I thought it was over Got me thinking my feelings over You keep doing it over and over Hello Cancers, so this is your mid-month reading. Um, this reading is going to be um, longer than what's typical. I'm going to include all signs towards like the middle or last third of the video. And also I'm going to be doing a career finance reading as well. So if you are dealing with someone or dealing with a couple people, definitely check out the all signs towards like the third of the, of the video. Okay. Let's look at the general messages first. Universe, give me three cards to guide. What messages do you have for cancers for the rest of this month? Okay, I see you guys are getting over something. Yep, you're getting some getting over something completely. You have peace with somebody or something, okay? Um, and you guys are feeling good. I feel like you guys are feeling back to yourself feeling emotionally stable. This could be an Aries who that's what I'm getting. I haven't done Libra. I'm gonna do yours. Or to do yours. I'm gonna do Libra after and Capricorn after. But I'm thinking cardinal signs are at peace. They're at peace that something didn't work out. At peace that something is what it is. Okay. And I'm, that's what I'm getting here. And you're happy. Also I'm seeing that you guys are gonna be go traveling. Some of you guys are gonna go to Brazil. Some of you guys are gonna go to Colombia, South America, probably you guys are from there. Now, let's see. Let's go with this deck. Okay, so you guys, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for cancer for the rest of this month? Universe, give me two more cards. What messages do you have for cancer for the rest of this month? Okay. So, general energy is tree affairs with family i see you spending a lot of time with family part of it's going to be a family vacation or a family re reunion teapot deep friendship with someone of the same sex then there's pineapple reconciliation then there's lobster finance a financial pinch and wall misunderstanding so i feel like you guys are going to um reconcile with old friends or family members that was exchanged. I feel like it was something petty, but I feel like you guys will, will be able to resolve this, okay? Probably it was around your birthday season. Um, something went down, okay? Let's look at the Kepra deck and I'm gonna go to the tarot. Okay, so universe, give me a three card spread unless just you have for cancers. Okay, so there's official person message. I see you guys gonna get accepted to a program, okay? This could be military as well. Also, I feel like if somebody was um, illegally trying to do something, um, you are going to get, like some guys are have a case right now, the judgment is gonna be rolling your favor. What else I'm getting here is probably someone who was accusing you of something. I feel like that's gonna be resolved, okay? Um, I honor message thief and community yeah that's what I'm seeing so someone was trying to like make you look bad but I feel like that's not gonna work hey okay, let's look at the tarot okay so universe give me a five card slide what messages do you have for cancers for the rest of this month universe queen of wands universe yeah, some guys are done with Aries or Pisces. Yep. So this person is still having beef with you, but I feel like you guys wash your hands with this. Okay. Universe, give me three more cards. Six of Wands. I feel like you guys move on, and they don't like that. Mm -hmm. Yep, you move on. They do not like this. Universe, give me one more card. Some of you guys are in a new relationship. Like, new. Like, you just got into this relationship, like, this Leo season. Okay, and someone don't like that. This could be like a baby mama, baby daddy that's like, don't like that you're moving on. 
an ex-husband, ex-wife, okay? Um, let's see. Universe, clarify six of wands. The magician of verse. Queen of cups in the verse. Yeah, I feel like this person was trying to see how they can, like, like mess with you. Trying to get your attention, but you didn't give them the attention. It didn't work. <laughs> the universe, clarify the queen of wands in the verse. The five of swords. This person is still petty. They're bitter. Okay. The universe cut by the eight of pentacles in reverse. The sun. I feel like the Leo energy is working for you. It could be at work. It could be at love. I feel like something is changing positively for you guys. So whatever you've been struggling the most. If it's regarding relationship. I see relationship getting better. If it's regarding finances. Your finance is getting better. Okay. This Leo season. The universe cut by the nine of wands in reverse. The Nine of Cups in a verse. This person is expecting you to be open to them like how you was once before, but you're not. And I feel like this is what's getting at them. They feel like you really have moved on. So, this person is just better. <laughs> I do see them trying to do something petty. Negatively trying to get your um, reaction from you, okay? Um, but you have moved on. So that's good. The signs, fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, or a earth sign, particularly a Virgo, towards Virgo, Capricorn, okay? There's some Pisces as well. Okay, so let's look. Okay, let's see here. Universe, give me a four card spread, and let's just see you have four cancers for the rest of this month. Universe, give me a four card spread. Universe, give me three more cards. Universe, give me one more card. Okay, so there's the Queen of Swords wishing. So there's a star. Some of you guys are dealing with a new Aquarius, complicated in love and cycles. I feel like you broke that soul tie. You no longer want to be with this person anymore. You found true love. Yeah, because I'm getting the stars. So like something that's healing, like a healing type of love. This could be your love for yourself. You found yourself again. Okay, so I like this. This is good. Good energy here. Um, let's look at your career finances. Okay, so universe. Universe, give me a four card spread. And let's just you have four cancers for the rest of this month. Universe, give me a four card spread. Okay, so this is what career finances, obstacles, overcoming obstacles. You can overcome anything. Fire climax approach, form one in Aries. First light, beginning a new cycle. Watching clouds, lay back, rest and relax. Crossing bridges, time for healing, connecting, mending, and releasing. Um, communication is key. New moon Gemini and ascending the mountains. Keep going forward, okay? So something that started a new job, a new position, or you started a new business, it's going very very well, okay? Um, I also see you guys are able to pay up, pay out old debts, old credit cards, old collections. I feel like you guys are able to pay in full and hold your vision fixed moon. I feel like you guys are really focused on your career and you're gonna see a lot of success because of that. So let's look at the, let's see. But the angel answers. And then we're going to go to the all signs. All right. So in universe, give me a four card spread. One message you have for cancers. So there's helpful people. Communicate clearly. And then there is no need to worry. Then there's not the right time. Then there's yes. Okay. So some of you guys are wanting to start a new business. Probably the universe wants you to plan stuff a little bit much better, okay? Probably the business plan hasn't been completely, comp it hasn't been completed just yet. But you have this urge, like you want to start. But the universe wants you to just take your time with it. Don't rush, okay? This could just be career as well. Um, probably you want to, probably you guys are PMs, okay? You want to implement a project real quickly. Um, the universe wants you to talk to your other um, team members, see like what's going to be the best for this project okay that's what i'm saying here so let's look at let's look at all signs we're going to start from aries and work 
throughout all the signs to Pisces. So let's see what's going on. The universe is going on with Cancer and Aries. Three cards. Universe is going on with Cancer and Aries. Universe is going on with Cancer and Aries. universe okay so there it is here and now truth be told and treasure island so you guys met with the new aries it looked good the path with money it's waiting for you to find it this is someone who's going to be very generous for the feminine cancer um staff look at that you, you will be taken care of in a difficult time yeah this person's going to be treating you like the queen that you are and then it's butterfly change for the better so this is a good aries coming your way if your ex is an aries I feel like you are successfully moving on from the X, but you're gonna need a new Aries that's gonna be better for you. Prior Aries with Moon and Cancer. Okay, let's see what Taurus is going on with you guys. Universe is going on with Cancer and Taurus. Universe is going on with Cancer and Taurus. Universe is going on with Cancer and Taurus. Okay, so there is yin. Okay, so someone feel like you are the divine feminine. The toys feel that way towards you. Elephant, a long journey, either physical or mental, will leave you wiser at the end. This person feel like they have mature ever since they met you. They feel like, wow, they feel like you're an angel to them. Okay, this is a like new Taurus. Spiritual guidance, protection from harm. If it is an ex, this is someone um, who feel like they didn't cherish you the way that they should cherish you. Um, but this is someone who's toxic, could have been abusive. Then there's fair man. Dealing a relationship with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair. Okay. So, let's look at Cancer and Gemini. Let's see what's going on with you guys. Okay. Universe is going on with Cancer and Gemini. Okay, all that glitters, building blocks, target, a goal-oriented person, and um, gavel, involvement with the law. Okay, so I did got that energy of like probably, um, this is what career though, I believe, career, or just general message. So probably you guys did um, had something with the Gemini, and Gemini was crossing you, not only emotionally, but they crossed you legally okay i feel like things gonna be real out in your favor okay um this is someone who was pretending to sh like they really care about you they really love you or you probably was really attracted to them but again all that glitters is in gold this person was fake i feel like this person was targeting you for some reason okay so let's look at cancer and cancer Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Cancer? So there is between worlds and truth be told. Okay, so Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Cancer? Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Cancer? Okay, so what I'm getting here base spiritual love as a base little lily spiritual love dark woman dealing or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair candles you should be shown away okay so with a cancer a cancer you deal with a cancer <laughs> um this person gonna show you how you should be loved okay that's what i'm getting now also when i look at two people doing, dealing with the same sign i also look at it as a a reflection of yourself a relationship with yourself too okay so what i'm getting here i feel like you guys are learning to love yourself unconditionally okay um 
you knowing that you are loved, you knowing that you deserve the best. And I feel like you guys are really treating yourself like such, okay? So that's good. Okay, so let's look at Cancer and Leo. Okay, so Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Leo? Universe. Versus what's going on with Cancer and Leo. Okay, Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Leo? Okay, so there is Here and Now, Rose. Romance is in the air and then Grapes. Time to get out of, go, go out and have fun. Okay, so here is showing that you're going to meet a new Leo. This you know you're gonna have a lot of fun together okay i feel like this is someone who's gonna wine and dine you okay this is someone who is gonna show you that they really want to be with you from jump okay so that's look good for you guys so let's look at cancer and virgo universe what's going on with cancer and virgo universe what's going on with cancer and virgo I feel like you're gonna be meeting a Virgo in school. So this fall semester, I think getting, or you're gonna reconnect with a Virgo or a Virgo trying to reconnect with you in school, okay? Happy, happy tree, affair with family. This is someone that you may have a child with or will be having a child with. Time to act lion, August. This is a Virgo August. It's a Virgo August. Uh, Virgo that's born in August, <laughs> okay? Dolphin, financial gain usually coming from something you did in the past. Camel, um, preserve and you will overcome problems. Butterfly, a change for the better. Apple, temptation will test you. So yeah, this is someone you have history with. Okay, dog barking, advice from a friend. This person could have been someone who was trying to keep things casual, okay, or friends with benefit. Heart, love, deep affection, and caring. And then angel, spiritual guidance, protection from harm, okay. So this person's having deeper feelings for you they're looking at things differently okay let's see what's going on with let me just open the door okay let's see what's going on with libra All right, so universe, what's going on with Cancer and Libra? Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Libra? Okay, universe, what's going on with Cancer and Libra? So there is Breathe, then it's Toy Toys, slowly, surely getting ahead. Dark woman dealing or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair and bull don't back down for opposition short strength and fortitude. I feel like you are gonna be moving on from a Libra, okay? Also, I'm seeing there's somebody that was really trying to like lead you on or trying to waste your time. You guys probably been in the talking piece for a long time, or you guys been there was like no progression, and they did it on purpose. Um, I feel like they was prioritizing someone else, okay? with that person being there the other person could have been a fire sign okay let's look at scorpio universe what's going on with cancer and scorpio universe what's going on with cancer and scorpio okay Here, what's the final one? Let's see here. Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Scorpio? Okay, so there is to be fair and deep knowing. Tower, well, I got some Scorpio reference. Fair man and four leaf clever. Okay, I feel like you it's going, it goes either way. Either you're gonna feel like you hit the jackpot or you feel like this was the worst connection you ever experienced, okay? So I feel like we're trying to say, 
this is an energy that's coming towards you this is a newer person so some of you guys are going to meet a phenomenal scorpio a evolved scorpio okay and then some of you guys are going to meet like the total chaotic toxic energy <laughs> okay um and i feel like it's really depending on your on your growth okay so what i'm trying to say here is definitely pay like pay attention to your energy and make sure are you actually ready to be in a relationship do you have a good relationship with yourself okay because i feel like you are going to be attracting how you feel inside okay so that's what i'm getting here that's that's it's like straight to the point some of you guys have not met this person yet so so some guys are probably looking at scorpio x so i feel like what i'm trying to say is clear the energy from the past really heal from any past energy so you can attract the best for you because the best might be a new scorpio okay but if you still feel like there's some things that you need to work on probably it's best not to be in a relationship right now because you might attract someone that's like really bad like toxic as hell okay so let's look at sagittarius okay universe is going on with cancer and sagittarius Right, universe is going on with Cancer and Sagittarius. Universe is going on with Cancer and Sagittarius. Okay, so regeneration and Sagittarius is going to come back. <laughs> I'm getting like coming coming back from the dead. So this is someone that you haven't heard from for a long time. Okay. This is someone you shouldn't trust, um, rat, someone who's working against you behind your back. This is someone who don't like you. They're trying to come back, though. Okay? Claw, be careful. Do not take risks. So with the Sagittarius, um, I feel like they might even have an STD. So just be careful with that. Look at that. This is someone who made empty promises, broken wishbone, and wish will not be granted. This is like a karmic, okay? Club, someone will try to make you do something against your will. Yeah, I'm, I'm seeing that they're... This was plotting on you. They don't like you. It's being very direct here. Um, they don't like you. They're going to pretend like they like you, but they don't. Um, strong emotion, passion, love, or hate. Yeah, so this is someone who feel like you did them wrong. Um, and I feel like they're going to come back. You haven't heard from them for a while. They have something. I don't know if they have an SCD or they trying to put you in some bad stuff. They, they Their intention is really bad. This person do not like you. They're bad. They're horrible. Okay. Flu, disappointment in a friend or lover. It could be your friend, too. Okay, so let's look at Cancer and Capricorn and see what's going on with you guys. Okay, Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Capricorn? Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Capricorn? Okay, so let's see here. Universe is going on with Cancer and Capricorn. I feel you're going to be a tall Capricorn. This Capricorn might be athletic. Okay. Or might be an athlete. Universe is going on with Cancer and Capricorn. So there is, by the book and Yen, they're going to feel like you are the Divine Feminine. They're going to be treating you as such. They know that you are a queen. Okay. Um, that's what I'm seeing. Okay. Then there is crib, a birth or consumption of a child enterprise. This person want to get you pregnant or want you to get, they want you to get them pregnant, okay? But they definitely see you as a divine feminine, as their wife, okay? Could be seeing you as a divine masculine as well or their, like, their husband, okay? So let's look at Cancer and Aquarius. Let's see what's going on. Universe, what's going on with Cancer and Aquarius? I just open that door again. Okay. So, let's see what's going on with Cancer and Aquarius. Okay, so I feel like you're going to meet this person. This person might be a doctor, a nurse, or work in a hospital. Okay, let's see here. Or work in a research lab.
Okay, so universe, what's going on with Cancer and Aquarius? Okay, so there's come to the edge, happy, happy, and clean it up. Okay, so this is this is a card for me of being lost, getting caught up with someone or something. Okay, um, I feel like with this person, you gotta love to be around them, but this person might serve as a distraction. Okay, so the universe wants you to create a balance. Okay, you guys probably been dating since May. Okay. Then there is ink pot problems to be resolved, or probably you guys broke up with this person since May. They're gonna try to fix it up with you if you want to fix it up, okay? Fix it, I mean. <laughs> so let's look at Cancer and Pisces. Okay, so universe, what's going on with Cancer and Pisces? Okay. So I guess they're doing athletes. I keep getting athletes. This person to be a footballer or something. Okay, so universe, what's going on with Cancer and Pisces? What's going on with Cancer and Pisces? Okay. So, okay, there is Orphan. Ooh, okay. One of you guys felt abandoned. Hell, time to get out of the situation and acts forces working against you okay yeah i feel like probably there is people that don't want you guys to be together it could be family it could be friends i see that you guys are probably not meant to be and one person feel like that's messed up okay or both of you guys may feel like it's messed up okay i'm getting like romeo and juliet that vibes um but i do see you getting out if this is someone who's not prioritizing you not putting your feelings in consideration i do see you getting out for good okay this could be them they may feel that way towards you as well so that's what i'm getting it could be like um someone that was trying to make you a third person okay or you was making that person a third person they finally getting out okay or you finally getting out so that's the reading that i have for you cancer thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if this video resonates you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queen at gmail.com and definitely check out King. King is offering the first 10 minutes for $1.99. I put the link in the description box. And also let me know if you guys like this longer type of video. Long longer type of reading um, with the all signs. Okay.